As of, uh, this is Gia Blazable from GamerFusion.com. What is going on, guys? I hope you guys are as excited as I am for all the new stuff that we saw in the stream. But I know there was not everything was shown on the stream, so I am bringing you guys up to date with all the new stuff that we are going to be getting on this April update. Right now, we're going to be covering all the ships that are going to be available for when the April update goes live. The first one we're looking at is called the last battle this is a black and red ship looks very very nice i would highly recommend you guys after you watch all the ships to let me know in the comment section below which one's your favorite and which one do you like the most also don't forget to share this video with your friends because sharing is caring so like i said this is called the last battle this is a black on red very nice looking ship and we are going to go ahead and move on to the second ship. This is almost similar to this one, but the only biggest difference that it has a blast cannon on the bottom and that it also comes with a black on blue plate. So if you guys know what we're seeing currently right now with Bungie is we are seeing that they're adding the chroma effect and they're going with different chromas. Right now the main chromas that we have are the red, blue, and yellow, and white chroma. The chromas, if you guys don't know or didn't watch the stream, they're pretty much glow effects that you're able to put on your gear and i would be kind of interesting if they actually added these to the ships because that would make them even more awesome looking like if this blue or the red on that first ship we saw had that chrome effect that would be very very nice this one's called the longest visual and this is a ship the next one we have this one is called lost legacy and this is a black and yellow ship this one seems to be the ship that we're probably going to be obtaining from trials of osiris if you guys notice it ha does have the trials of Osiris emblem right dab in front of it so it might be one that we pick up in Charles of Osiris I mean based on the emblem that's what I'm going with but let me know if you guys agree or disagree next up we have the new ship this one actually looks very very nice I do like the fact that this kind of reminds me a lot of uh uh, it's just my personal point of view, but it does remind me a lot of Star Wars uh, just because of that nice gray and white chroma effect. This one's called the Space Age Mariner. This is a new ship that we're going to be seeing in the April update. So I'm really looking forward to picking this one up. But the one that caught everybody's attention that everybody I'm sure is going to be trying to get is the next one up. And that one, my friends, is the Warning Star. This is a ship that you're able to obtain from the POE. Very, very cool taken ship i've been wanting one of these ships forever uh not in the sense that i knew that it was coming but in the sense that we've talked about it so many times i wish there was a taken ship there wish there was a taken sparrow i'm actually glad to finally see a taken ship something we definitely want let me know in the comment section below which one was your favorite ship which one do you guys want to try to get and also don't forget to share it guys with your friends and don't forget guys for all things destiny head over to gamerfusion.com where we empower your gaming